Hi guys, my name is Crystal and you're watching Budget by the Bag. In the thumbnail, you'll notice that this is my birthday month. I am a Libra and my birthday falls on October 14th. This year, it lands on a Friday and I am so thrilled because I am going with a few friends to the casinos to eat, drink, and gamble a little bit. This part of the year, the last three months, are my favorite. The weather's nicer here in Texas. You've got cooler weather. In today's video, we're going to unstuff my wallet. We're going to replenish my wallet. I will show you a new savings binder that I've created. Last but not least, I want to share something with you. It's something personal. I am starting this uh, program and I want to share that with you in this video. So grab a drink, a snack, and let's get started. Let's go ahead and count the money. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90. So 490. I live by a small airport. I think I might have mentioned this before. So you'll hear some airplanes flying around. First, we're going to see what's left in my wallet. I'm going to pull out my dividers. Okay. The first category is gas, and I have $10. The next is family, and I have five, six, seven, eight, nine dollars left over. We have food. Food, I have five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Fun, oops, I have ten, eleven, twelve. Miscellaneous, one, two, three, four, five. Personal, I did get my eyebrows threaded and I have left over one, two, three, four. Shopping. 10, 15, 20, 25, 26. Tips, I have one, two, three. So now I'm gonna reset and replenish my dividers. Gas is getting $90. So let's try to get the raggediest 20s. Twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, ninety for gas. This is going to be for two weeks. Family is going to get a twenty. I think it's just going to be a twenty dollar bill. Food is getting twenty as well. This is if I want to grab Starbucks or a quick snack. Fun. Fun is getting $25. I'm taking Jacob to a birthday celebration, so maybe he needs something there. Miscellaneous is getting 10. I believe I'm gonna do two fives for that. So five, 10. We have personal and I'm giving myself 15, so let's do a 10 and a five. Shopping, okay. This is my birthday month, as I mentioned in the intro. I am giving myself some extra funds for uh, the casino. Um, I have some other money set aside for the casino, but you know, this is just a little buffer. Plus, I wanna get a pedicure done, I want, may want to get a new shirt for my birthday to wear that Friday. And just, you know, little stuff like that. So, shopping is getting $300. 20, 40, 60, 81, 
$93 in shopping. And that also means I will not be stuffing as aggressively in my sinking funds this month due to increasing my shopping so much. Tips is getting 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And that's how I'm going to allocate my money this time around. This will be for two weeks worth of funding. If I um, go over with food, I will pull out for my eating out sinking funds that I have. So I'm not too worried that $20 may not be enough. I have buffer also in my checking account if I need it, but I will try to take it out of the sinking funds for like food, which is eating out, fun, I, you know, I have a sinking fund for that, um, so forth. Now I'm gonna put this in my wallet. I do have some change. I'm gonna pull that out as well, and I'll need a quarter to show you my new savings challenge. So let's count what I have left in rollover. I have 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 56, 70, 89, 60, 1, 6, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 6, 9, 70, then 1, 7, 2, 7, 3, 7, 4, 7, 5, 7, 6, 7, 7, 7, 8, 79, $79 for rollover, and then I will grab my binder next. Okay, we're going to use my rollover to stuff five challenges. The first savings challenge I want to share with you is my $75 ballerina nail scratch off. I'll link my shop in the description box below because it's on forthecreator.com. Now for this particular one, each nail is going to be less than $10. I thought this was um, a good start off for my first challenge. So I've got my quarter and let's do this one. Of course, the highest number. Okay, so it's a $10 value. I have a 10 and we're going to put that in. Let's um, go to the next challenge and then if we have left our money, we'll come back and scratch another one. I have 75, 100, 200, 250, 300, 400, and $500 options. The next challenge I have is my $60 Happy Mail Savings Challenge. I wanted to do something small and something that's fun that I can use with the small rollover that I have. I don't think I'll have a lot of 20s, um, so that's why I kept it to 10 fives and ones in these challenges. So let's start off with a five and a few ones. You can get um, this challenge on my shop. It has 60, 120, and 300. So we're gonna do five. You know what, let's do a two. I changed my mind. This is my favorite color, maroon. Let's do another one or a one and then we'll do another one. So five, seven, eight, nine. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. We may come back to this one. I'm just it's my first time getting back into the groove of things and just want to make sure I have enough money to hit everything. The next challenge I'm doing is my $80 Ballerina Nail Savings Challenge. Each nail is worth $5. This comes in a three pack as well on one sheet. I believe there's 80, 160, and I forgot the next 
value. I think it's like 510, maybe 15 or 510 and a 20. I will, you know, show a picture if I haven't. Let's do a 10 and put on a sticker for two of the $5 values. And that's what it looks like. And we'll put this back in. The next challenge is my cell phone challenge. I have a full sheet, but I decided to make a mini challenge. You'll get 250, a 500 and a $1200 cell phone mini savings challenge. Three on one sheet of paper. Okay. Let's see here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm going to do a seven. And then I want to do six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's do a five next. Let's see how many ones do I have left over? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's do two. I guess in theory I could have done that too, but I think I just wanted to be random. In the challenge, we are putting in 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. We may come back to this one, but for now, this is good. My last challenge I want to reveal is play a playlist savings challenge. This is free. You get three versions with this challenge. The idea is you find a channel who needs help with watch hours. And let's say at night you charge your phone. You're going to bed. Find a channel who needs help with their watch hours. You find a playlist and you let it run while you're sleeping, while it's charging. You don't have to worry about anything. And then you come back, you put their name on there and you'll give each playlist a value. Now I'm going to do one dollar. I have not filled it in yet, but I wanted to share that with you. So each time I do this is going to be a dollar per playlist. The idea of me putting a dollar is I'm going to try to do 10 every time you see me cash stuff my wallet. So I'm thinking every two weeks I will be playing the challenge. I may print up another one so I can have maybe 10 more if I have free time to do that. You can play a playlist while you're sleeping. Let's say you're cleaning and you want to listen to some music. You can listen to music on your phone, but have it uh, play the playlist on your TV. Let's say you're at work, you're concentrating, but you don't need your phone and it's charging or it has enough juice. You pick a channel who needs help and you play their so, playlist. So far, I have sleeping, while you're sleeping, while you're cleaning, while you're working. There are so many ways you before can Before you exit out of this video, let me know if you need watch hours. Leave a comment. First, like this video, okay? Because I sometimes feel like people forget to like the video. They comment, but they may forget. So like this video. Let me know in the comment section, do you want me to play a playlist for you? And I will. I will put your name on an Excel spreadsheet and I'll probably end up going in order. And what do I mean by that? Whoever uh, comments first, I will start off with you. And I will ask 
you know, the next video who still needs, you know, hours. I'm just gonna keep adding to my Excel spreadsheet. I'll say, hi, I am going to be playing your playlist tonight, hashtag playlist. I think that's what I wanna do is do hashtag playlist. So you know that you're being part of this play a playlist savings challenge. I hope that wasn't confusing and I hope that you will join me in this movement. I will definitely have this filled out the next time because I will be starting that soon. Okay, so we have 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Hmm. Let's do another scratch off because this video is running long. Let's do this one. Okay, so we have another See, we have five dollars and let's do a top okay so we have ten dollars on the scratch off i'm going to clean that up and i'll put it, um, it back in the envelope so now we have 20 here let's see happy mail Let's do one, two, three. All around this three. And now it has five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. It's pretty good. I keep forgetting to put this in the front. Ballerina, I don't think I'm gonna do that. Let's let's do some more of the cell phone challenge. How much do I have now? 10, 15, 16, 17. Let's see. Let's do another two. Nine. So that's eleven. Ten. 11, that leaves six. Let's do a three. And another three. So cell phone has 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 23. Cell phone has 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37. And we are done with my savings challenge binder. Next, we are gonna talk about what's going on with me. I want you to know this is not sponsored. I wanna share something that is personal that I'm going through. Um, it's nothing serious, but it's something that has definitely been a problem self-consciously for me. I'm going to start the Invisalign Smile Express. My teeth look straight sometimes when you're taking pictures, but they're not. In the dead, in the center of the top and bottom of my teeth, they are inverted or indented and I would like to fix them. I've never had the money to do it because back then it would have cost thousands of dollars. We didn't have that money and now we can afford because we have an HSA through my husband's work, we can afford this program. It's called the Express because I'm literally going to be doing this for six to nine months. I want to share what's in this box and let you know what I'm getting for the Smile Express. I want to share maybe before and after pictures at some point. I just want to share this with and you I want to and share I hope what's that. in the box because it's going to affect this channel, I believe. I feel that my uh, mouth will have some type of adjustment. So when I'm recording, you might hear a lisp. I just wanted to be upfront with that. This is why I'm sharing this with you. 
I feel that you might notice and maybe I'll notice when I go to edit um, a video. So let's go over what's in the box. And I might be blurring out a portion of this because um, it has my full name and I'm not ready to share any of that. So it has like a welcome card section. So I'm gonna pull that out. It says, hi, it tells me I have one, two, three cards. The first one is the starting line, smile care guide, aligner care tip, smile express FQA. It talks about meeting your liners, taking before photos, which I plan to do. I'm waiting for my husband to get home. And then you try your liners. The idea is that you have to wear them from 20 to 22 hours. I'm gonna try to stick to the 22 hour. And it tells you how to keep them clean. And then it talks about um, saving the liners. Don't overheat them. You use your chewies, and I'll explain what those look like. It's got an emery board to kind of um, smooth them out if they're too sharp, and how to keep them safe. And then FQAs. The first one is, will I talk funny? And they say for the first few days, you'll notice a slight lisp. Will they hurt? What can I eat? What if there's a problem? These are the liners. There's one through 20. And there's a goodie bag here. Let's see. Okay, come on. In the goodie bag, there's a bite me. Let me share what that looks like. We have a tra we have a travel tooth brush, and then in the bottom you can put refillable toothpaste. Put that in my purse. Here's the emery board. A lip moisturizing. Uh, lip balm. They gave me mouthwash. And then here are the Chewies. This is what it looks like. You just bite on them to make sure that the liners stay snug inside your mouth. And last but not least is the case for the liners. and it has a mirror. So I wanted to share that with you. I hope that you will not notice a change in the way I talk, but I wanted to share what's going on with me and this will go on anywhere from six to nine months. Since I have 20 of these, that's probably seven, seven and a half uh, months. And I will share some pictures before and after. Don't forget to comment if you need watch hour time.